What do you think you do? <laughs> oh, great. Today, we're playing GTA Online. We're back again, but this time, it's not just a normal build of any normal random car. We are building this beautiful Bravado Gauntlet Classic. Now, we're not only building it to be the best bloody classic mobile you've ever seen in your life. This is going to be a Benny's Custom Mobile. I am super excited. We actually built this car. Not, It doesn't feel like that long ago. Probably was, to be fair. We built this car, and it looks fantastic. The amount of stuff you can do, like blowers and the like. Fantastic. But our boy Benny is back. We thought he was dead. I thought Rockstar had literally murdered the man. But we got the news that Benny is back in town, and he is here to build some spicy, spicy machines. I'm so happy. So all the cars that was added to Benny, specifically, all of the cars are old. They're available already. They've been available for a while. They've now just got even more customization. And I think this is probably the best one that you can build, at least the one that people are going to be most excited for. From what I've seen on the pictures already, I've been trying to avo avoid most of it. But my, my, my boy, it's Benny. Woo, woo, woo. Benny, I am proud to be back. How you doing? You look a little bit different. You, lo you lost weight. You lost weight. So this thing already cost 615,000 and we're now going to upgrade it to the Benny's Classic Custom. So we we're going to go f it's going to cost us a million total. Basically just over a million to fully make this thing into a Ben... Holy crap! <laughs> look at that! That's actually awesome. I've seen... I've seen... That you can you could get. I didn't know it was gonna enable it by default, but that is pretty pretty awesome. So we already did have one of these, but I didn't want to make it and ruin it. If that makes sense, like I don't want to take away from what we already built. I was gonna say I couldn't really see what it was doing to be honest, but it's doing more stuff at the bottom than anything else. Ah, oh, well, here we go. We got the twin insert piggy nose, and we got secondary, which I imagine is to do with the color. So we've got 14 options here. I do quite like having that indent there. Do I like the two or the one? I like the one. And I think we're going to go for the the primary. Uh, rear bumpers, not as many. The back end, it, it looks a little bit bare compared to the front end. I'm going to be completely honest. I do quite like the painted look, so I think we're going to go for that. So very clearly, they are quite inspired by the Dodge Daytona for this car. Uh, do we want the aerial? Yeah, I've got, of course I want a bloody aerial. It makes it feel classic, feel spicy, if you will. We've got a secondary on the rear. We've got the stock rear cover. I quite like the stock rear cover. We've got roll cages in here, just in case you wanted. Let's actually go to the first person view and get an idea of what the col the, the colge. The cage is going to be like, I'm going to go for the secondary cage. Some strip on the front. I'm actually going to go, let's go for the secondary. Engine upgrades. There's no like visual engine upgrades. So Benny's was really, really good about being able to do that. But we actually only get... The performance upgrades for... Oh, we got side exit exhausts. Oh, yeah. You already know. Oh, that is beautiful. I wish we could have a combination of the two. That would be sick. But I will take the dual side pipes. And then the fenders. We got some holy fenders. Every time we every time we put a piece on, it seems to be revving. Need for speed. Eat your heart out. I mean, come on. Please. We're going to go for the, the doubles there. Headlight covers. Oh, great. We can change them. That's awesome. I was I was hoping that we could change them up just a little bit. We've got primary, uh, secondary, and we can black them kind of internally. I quite like that. So I think we'll go for this is the nice option. Hood. There's so many customization options on Benny's cars. And that's why people love it so much. They want to see more, more, more. Hood catches. Hood. We've got the full custom hood available. Please tell me we've got some blowers. Please tell me we've got blowers. If you don't have a blower... I oh! <laughs> oh, baby. That is sick. And look at that! It opens and closes as well. I think I'm going to go for this one, though. That looks the most ridiculous. Absolutely mental. Just totally unnecessary, to be honest with you. So we've got dash customization as well. We can actually put the uh, street interior in here, which actually gives us pedals, because apparently we don't need pedals initially. And then we can put the rally dash. That's pretty cool. And all the way at the other end, we've got a bit of carbon. I'm actually I'm quite digging that, to be honest with you. 
So we can do quite a lot of interior stuff on this Benny's car. Uh, on all the Benny's cars. I do quite like having a lot of dials, but I'm going to try and keep it somewhat clean. We've got the door cards as well. I think I'm probably going to end up with the standard door cards. The seats. I'm going to keep the standard seats. I'm going to keep it like a good mix. Maybe like... We'll change the steering wheel just a little bit, just to make it a little bit more race car-y. And light colour, we can actually change the dash dials. I'm not going to bother with that. Liveries, we've got Bravado. We've got the white gauntlet, black gauntlet, red gauntlet. Number 36. Oh, that is awesome. You already... That is fantastic. I do like that a lot. I think the actual Dynaco car was 43. The fact that I can remember that, but <laughs> I'm going to put it on. You already know I'm putting it on. we got mirrors. we got chrome mirrors. Actually, I think I'm normally a chrome delete man, but to be honest with you, with a car like this, I kind of I kind of dig the chrome just, just a little bit. We've got the chrome blower on the front, so I think it all ties in quite well. Respray. You already know we're going for another blue car. We're going for the classic paints. And we're gonna we're gonna set this up perfectly. So we could go for the full blue, or we could go for kind of like a, a two-tone black roof. And I think, quite honestly, I'm gonna go with that. That looks the nicest. We can trim color and emblem as well. We got roof. We got, oh, we can actually cheat. Ah, oh, we can make it a carbon roof if we want to. It does remove the stickers, but you know what? It makes it a little bit clean. So we're going for the carbon roof. Side skirts as well. There's so many options for these Benny cars. I really hope that some like more Japanese machines get added to this. Of course, I'm grateful that these were added. Just because we I guess we really haven't had that many muscle cars per se. We've had some like low riders and the like. But nothing like super muscle car-y. Thank God for the splitter at the front. That is fantastic. Oh, I like that a lot. I think I'm actually I'm actually gonna go with the primary color. We got spoil. Of course, we got spoilers. I feel like we're getting close to the end, but then I realized we haven't even got a wang on it. Oh yes, primary color wang, secondary color wang. We got the secondary race. Oh, it's actually a little bit different, and it <laughs> and it ties onto the back there. Oh my god, I'm I'm temp. You know what? I'm going with the Mark III. I just think, just to change it up, just a little bit. Transmission, fully upgraded. Turbo, fully upgraded. Wheels. Do I want to change the wheels? They already look pretty damn good. We're going to keep the current wheels just because they suit. They, they, pretty, they are pretty close to how it was. We've got parachute on the back as well with a wheelie bar. You already know. Windows, light smoke. Uh, we got the... Ri we got window wangs as well? They're spoiling me. Absolutely spoiling me. I just realized as well, we could actually add front vents on as well as rear vents some of the options actually allow you to pick multiple i didn't even know that there we are outside of benny's in my dynaco mobile that looks fantastic the lights go down when you get out that's just what you want it's a shame there ain't no proper oval racetrack because this would be perfect for that since it's 4am i'm actually gonna wait i'm gonna wait to drive this so you can see it in the light just a little bit more, but I'll give, give you one more listen before we go. <laughs> We're back with a little bit more daylight, and this thing is looking so much better in the daylight. Something about GTA's nighttime, I, I like I like it, but I want to see the cars in the flesh in the daylight, see them, how they drive, how they reflect. I guess in, at night they will reflect, reflect pretty well once we get that ray tracing. I'm excited. I'm excited for that. All right. Anyway. This thing, it's probably not going to drive very well. I'm going to be honest, I, I didn't go in expecting this to drive very well. This is not a car that you would buy for the sake of it driving very well. And it is also pouring it down with the poo poo rain. Just like real life right now. We've just started to get storms. The temperature is cooled down like 15 degrees. We're down to about 20. Which is not bad. It's more acceptable for British, British summertime. It, it, it's absolutely... It's going to be peeing it down for the next couple of weeks. So, um... I'm also kind of terrified because there is a lightning storm, and I kind of do like having my video not cut out while I'm recording it. So let's hope that, <laughs> that doesn't happen. So I, yeah, I went with like the semi Dynaco look. I didn't want to go fully because I, I never want to fully accurately re recreate them in GTA because it's not the real car in the first place. But this, I think, is as close as we could possibly get in GTA. It does have the wheelie bar, so I'm actually I'm I'm, I'm gonna have to do a wheelie, aren't I? I completely forgot that you can actually do wheelies in this game. 
That was really actually a pathetic wheelie. <laughs> I'm not exactly sure he's doing wheelies very well, to be honest. Try again. Oh, there, that was a little bit better. It's really not letting you do wheelies. This wheelie bar is quite restrictive, I would say. If you're looking for something to actually do wheelies in, I think the standard version actually wheelied a lot better. But the wheelie bar may just be stopping it. Maybe we've put too much weight on it. Maybe it's now too heavy. All right, I think that's going to about do it. Check out the car yourself. I would actually recommend building this one because it is a very, very cool one. Of course, it's got bennies. It's a shame that we couldn't do any, like, the engine customization. There was no, like, other than putting a blower on it. It's pretty, like... Thunderstorm. It's pretty bare bones for Benny. But Benny was a bit over the top before, and now he's calmed down just a little bit. But I want to over the top Benny back. All right. Thanks so much for watching this video. Be sure to smash like, subscribe if you're not. See you in the next video. Until next time, peace.